Seattle Sonics. The NBA owners voted today to move the team to Oklahoma City pending the outcome of the city's June court case. King Fi's Chris Daniels was there for the announcement and had a testy exchange with the commissioner, David Stern. Chris joins us live tonight from Manhattan. Chris. And Dennis, good evening. Clay Bennett clearly her got over a big hurdle with this 28 to 2 vote by the NBA owners, but the talk after the vote quickly turned to discussions between the NBA, the Sonics, and the city of Seattle. NBA Commissioner David Stern called the city's approach in those discussions a, quote, scorched earth policy, and he got rather testy when he talked about the past and the future of NBA basketball in Seattle. The NBA Board of Governors uh, approved. Um, you know, the move of the Sonics to Oklahoma City. NBA Commissioner David Stern says the vote was nearly unanimous, and the Sonics will move to Oklahoma City either this year or in 2010 at the end of their Key Arena lease. And they've talked about getting involved again. Right, in but, January, that would be, but, arena, but that would be the fourth time. That would be the fourth time. The Key time. Arena remodel I'll as let it you stands finish. right Go now. Ahead. Stern was combative at times when I asked him about a future Key Arena remodel and whether he believed recently uncovered emails show Clay Bennett acted in good faith negotiations to keep the team in Seattle. Have you had a chance to read through those emails? My response, yet? as I've been reminded, wasn't lengthy at all. <laughs> so you're have, have you're, you have you read through is, have you read through those emails, especially you know, those between Mr. Bennett and the other owners? live or not? I don't like to be interrupted, and I'm not going to interrupt you. So why don't we just go to the next question? And there's been an enormous uh, misunderstanding of that, misrepresentation of that. And A more subdued Bennett defended the emails and says while he's excited for Oklahoma City. I also uh, want to express my regret to the citizens of Seattle and the fans of the Sonics that, that I was unsuccessful. Bennett also made a statement which figures to play a part in negotiations with the city and the future of basketball in Seattle. How tied are you right now to taking the franchise name, team colors, and franchise history with you to Oklahoma City? Uh, I think at the end of the day, um, I, I believe the name should probably stay. And, and the history and the marks and the colors should probably stay. That's my personal opinion. But it needs to be a part of a broader discussion. And the broader discussion is code for those lease buyout negotiations. The team history and colors is clearly a big chip for Clay Bennett in this case. And those talks will certainly heat up as we get closer and closer to that June 16th trial date in the lawsuit for the city of Seattle versus the Seattle Supersonics. Live tonight in Midtown Manhattan at Rockefeller Plaza, Chris Daniels, King 5 News. Chris, only two votes against the move. Those votes. We know the two votes came from Mark Cuban, the owner of the Dallas Mavericks, and Seattle native Paul Allen, who owns the Portland Trailblazers. Chris Daniels, live tonight in New York City. The decision comes not only as a major disappointment to Sonics fans, but to a Sonics legend as well. I think right now we're all disappointed. We're all saddened. You know, uh, we won a championship here. That's, uh, we became part of the community. Lenny Wilkins coached the Sonics when the team won the championship in 1979. He says seeing the team leave means losing the chance to see history repeat itself. Some fans are not ready to accept that the team is really leaving, and Seattle Mayor Nichols is not throwing in the towel just yet. We're focused on June. We're focused on winning that litigation and keeping the team here. Stay with King 5 for continuing coverage of this decision. We'll have more in sports. And if you want to see the complete press conference or sound off for yourself, Go to king5.com.